I wanted to speak to you this evening as we prepare to exit the two-week circuit breaker imposed by the executive to help slow the spread of COVID-19 and protect the health service. From tomorrow, some restrictions are being lifted, for example, on non-essential retail and parts of our hospitality sector. It has been another very difficult time for our local businesses and for our community too, with many families unable to meet up in the way that they would like to. The cold, dark evenings are certainly more of a strain on all of us as we battle to keep coronavirus under control. As we look forward to Christmas bringing a, a little festive cheer, I know many of you will be wanting to show your support to our local businesses. Christmas is such a vital time for them. And in support of the Council's Make It Local Awareness campaign, I sincerely urge people to buy from local suppliers and producers uh, across our district. The towns and villages across Newry Morn uh, and Down boast a fantastic variety of choice and quality, so please enjoy what they have on offer. However, safety is absolutely key. Follow the restrictions in place, don't forget to bring your face covering, wash or sanitise your hands and keep your distance while queuing up or moving around the store. If you see a crowded area, turn back. Essentially, be sensible and take care to help keep your fellow shoppers and shop staff safe. We, we've also been hearing of the Christmas bubbling arrangements agreed by the Northern Ireland Executive. Three households, including one in an existing bubble, can get together indoors between the 23rd and 27th of December. There is no limit on the number of people within the Christmas bubble, but it is important that you keep it as small as possible. We all want the, the people we care about the most to be safe, to be spending not just this Christmas with us, but Easter with us, summer holidays with us, and, and enjoying Christmas next year with us. To be honest, we are concerned as to what could happen in January and February if COVID does not remain under control over December. Cases are still higher than we would like uh, and what happens in the new year is very much dependent on the next few weeks. I appreciate all of this is a difficult balance to strike and personal responsibility does come into play. It can be incredibly frustrating to try to follow the health guidance as best as we can and to know there are others who, who don't seem to care. So I really want to thank all of those who have been trying. Every time you follow the public health guidance and limit your contacts, you are doing your bit and potentially saving lives. So please keep going. Stay safe this Christmas and protect your loved ones.